Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on this channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Malin and today we are building a pumpkin house. Yes. <laughs> and happy Halloween everyone. How's your Halloween going? Me myself, I have been watching tons of horror movies. I even got nightmare because of that, <laughs> but it was so much worth it. So this is for the Sim Hang collab that so many amazing Simers have participated in. We have like Sadie Sim, Kate Emerald, Ivor M, Freezer Bunny, The Sim Stream, Pugone, Devon Bumpkin, and so many more. I can, I can, oh my god, I can, I can sit have a, sit here for hours and take them all up because they are pretty much so many Simers in it. <laughs> <laughs> I think we are like over 80 simmers or something so but you you all should check them out I have added the sim hang playlist and also the link where you can check out all the who participated and their information in the description below so please check them all out they are all such amazing creators and I had so much fun building this pumpkin house that I I'm so proud it's actually it's a pumpkin okay and as you all can see the it is a pumpkin from spooky pack that i just scaled up and at first i was just thinking to build a house with like small pumpkins for season <laughs> and stack them on top of each other but um like in the shape of a house but then i was thinking why not just try a pumpkin and, and scale it up and it worked I got so amazed that it works, but there is a little problem <laughs> that you all would notice in maybe three days in Sims or so. And that is that the pumpkin will sadly mold because there is a pumpkin that a Sim carved out. So yes, <laughs> it will mold and be nasty. But to my defense, it is Halloween build, okay? It is for Halloween and it's only like one day or so i know that people are having halloween for like a month and something but but in this game it's for one day so i think that was a pretty good defense i was thinking that i should start to the build first but then i changed my mind because it was pretty hard to place the pumpkin where i wanted it so i thought it was better to just place the pumpkin first then place the floor just inside it and then I just raised it up in the level I wanted and then I just put walls all around and also on the second floor. I was on the same stream yesterday and they were talking about the new pack Snow Escape and wow, I'm so excited for this pack guys. The world is so beautiful and the new item seems to be so cool as well and you don't need the season pack to get the snow in in snow escape so that's good but the snow will only be able in the snow escapes worlds and not in the other worlds if you don't have the season pack of course but i'm so much more excited for is the new platform tool we will get in an update we will finally be able to create a room with different floor levels and also stack platforms on each other and this will work even on the second floor and also in an apartment that's really cool <laughs> oh my can you imagine what you can build i mean i have so much ideas in my head already on what i will create i'm really excited for this update and this is seriously something I've been waiting for, for so long. And others as well, and simmers, can interact with each other on different height levels in the room. It's so cool! We will also get more new half walls in, the, in this update, which is also very exciting. And I am so happy we find, finally will get it in The Sims 4. I'm sorry, I sound so excited, but this is really something I've been waiting for for so long. I thought we would never get that in The Sims 4, so I'm so happy we finally will get it. <laughs> it's a dream, really. But, I mean, let's stop talking about that and talk about something else instead. I will also tell you that a new speed build video will be released soon. It is my Baba Yaga house. <laughs> that will be upla uploaded in just a few days. 
I made my pumpkin house and Baba Yaga house like at the same time. So, and talented Ivor M has created the Baba Yaga witch for me. And you will see Baba Yaga in my video. She is so beautiful, but also scary at the same time because on the day she is a beautiful woman who lures innocent children to come in to eat lots of lots of food and cakes and candy. And when the children are done, she transforms to a true self, which is a horrible, scary old witch that eats children. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my god, so cringe. <laughs> I will put Ivory M's uh, YouTube channel and Twitch channel in the description down below. So, I can't wait for it to start snow here in Sweden. Hopefully we will get snow this year. Last year it wasn't much snow here actually, at least not where I live. So hopefully it will be much this year. My mother says that if there is a lot of rovenberry on the trees, there will be a lot of snow. Mm -hmm. And she has not actually been wrong about that, if I'm gonna be honest. And there is a lot of rovenberry on the trees this year, so if there is not much snow, then I will be disappointed with the rovenberry theory. I'm sorry mom, but I will. Uh, because I may be an adult, but I love to go sledding also, because I can't ski. <laughs> I just don't know how to do it. <laughs> I've heard that you should pretend holding a pizza box while standing on skis for your balance, but I don't know about that though. <laughs> I haven't tried. I don't know if I should do that either, to be honest. But in this pandemic, it's not an option to go out now and practice anyway, so I guess I will do that when this horrible pandemic is over. I want to talk about my world save file once more. It's about my last build I did, the Creek House, and people are asking me where can I download your build, I can't find it in the gallery and so on. And I forgot to tell you all in my last video that the build will not be uploaded until my world save file is done. When it's done, I will upload every build to the gallery because there will be people that maybe don't want to save file and just the builds or a few builds. So I thought it would be a good way to do that way. So for everything to fit good, I needed to make the walls on the second floor tall. And this was perfect because then I could make a loft. And when you get closer to the pumpkin, it also disappears, so it won't disturb you while you play. Everything is play tested, and yes, it does work. So that's good. So this house is built on a 40 by 30 lot in uh, Glimmerbrook. It is very open, and it has two beds and one bathroom. And I was thinking that because it is a pumpkin house, a plant sim would fit for this build. It's pretty nasty in the real pumpkin before you remove everything inside. But in this pumpkin, I decided to place much greenery like plants and a lot of clutter. And I recently bought the, the Star Wars pack and I love the new items. It is perfect for clutters and this build will not be in the world save file, just so you know. It also has a lot of packs I use. so. I don't think it's good to have it in the save file and you can already download it so it's already up on the gallery. I'm so proud of the fireplace I made. I scaled down the fireplace and placed it with the tool mod where I wanted it to be and then I just scaled down some stones from the Star Wars pack and placed them all against the wall and then I used a small bonfire from Outdoor Retreat and just placed it on top of the fireplace and the stones. But um, the, the bonfire does not work though. It's not really the point either, it's only there for decoration and it's the fireplace that will work. You just hide it a little bit so you barely can see it and it works. I also want to tell you that I stream on Twitch and it would be so much fun if you would come and so that I also can get to know you guys. As you all can see I didn't place any TV in this home. If you want a TV then, then please uh, place it yourself, but I didn't think it would really fit to this build, if I'm gonna be honest. I just thought 
that there is just a lot of plants and greenery so it would look kind of weird if there is a TV there and I wanted the fireplace to be there. I didn't make any child's room in this build. At first I was thinking that maybe I should make the small house to a little child but I changed my mind. I made it more like a skill room instead. The wall plants it's from Jungle Adventure and I just love them. They fit so well in the interior. This isn't really a scary build I know but I could have made it so much more creepy but I just thought that the idea with the pumpkin should be with lots of plants and roots and especially if it is for a plant sim as well then I think it should be hanging plants and a lot of greenery and have a lot of candles and make it a little cozy jungle feeling. So when you see this, I am late with uploading this video. I said I would upload this video at 7 p.m. Swedish time. It is 6.45 p.m. for me. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> I just want to say thank you all so, so, so much for your lovely support. I have said it many times and will continue to say it that you all are amazing and you are the ones that makes me motivated to upload more videos on this channel and I'm so happy you want me to create more and more speed builds. It really makes me glad because I have never really liked my voice or my accent especially in English so this really makes me happy and the video will soon end. And I just want to say that don't forget to give a thumbs up and to subscribe and <laughs> to click on that notification bell. Because if you do, you won't miss any of my videos. Happy Halloween everyone, stay amazing and please take care of yourself and each other and stay safe. Bye bye! <laughs>